what's going on you guys welcome to another video what's your boy Abe Shaw I believe this is episode what episode is this this might be episode six if I'm not mistaken if it's not a in this video just go ahead and go back and update it but what you're seeing over here to the left right now I think I'm a excuse me this is this video I don't know what's all gonna be pertaining in this video today today it might just be like a simple just behind the scenes of what it looks like what i do on the weekend if i'm not like going out or hanging out with friends or cousins or whatever that look like what am i doing as far as from the business nah, from the business side of things right so right now currently uh on the weekends usually the time where i actually set aside to like try to see what kind of updates can i do to my academy what are things that i can improve on what are things that i can make the academy better so each and every weekend i try to find different ways to hop up the value that I'm giving to you guys for my actual academy members. So like if you're on YouTube and you're not part of the academy yet, this is kind of like what it looks like on my weekends. Sometimes I do it during the week as well. We During the week is more so updates on trade ideas, trade alerts, SPS, US 30, different things like that. Along with the wealthy talk section, like where I'm actually talking to them. But weekend, okay, cool. Like what is the update that I'm doing? So I guess I can kind of like show you all the behind the scenes. Uh, dang, actually, I should show you my new desk set. I got a whole new desk set up and everything now. But uh, currently, right now, I'm creating a new updated version of how my academy operates. So right now, you're kind of seeing like, well, you can't really see it as I zoom in. So y'all don't really need to see everything. But basically, over here is like everything. Right now, I'm updating my beginner section, and I'm updating. I'm updating the layout. Hold on, I got J Cole playing in my ears. That's storm me off. But I'm updating the layout. So usually before it was just the videos. Like when you come to my academy, you see like the videos here. Actually, I can show y'all. Let's exit out of this. Let's actually go all the way back. And I can show y'all what my academy looks like currently. All right, so currently, I've definitely done a YouTube video like this before. And let's zoom in a little bit. How's my battery already about to die, bro? That's so irritating. All right, so look, so this is currently like what my homepage would look like. Well, what your homepage would look like if you joined the academy. Uh, news for the week, your study recap. So skip all that. Start your journey. This takes you into the academy section where all the videos and stuff are at. So currently, uh, let's go full screen on this. So currently, it's still a straight, right? So like you got a big old arsenal of information of all the videos and stuff that I have going on, but. When we talk about this section, I clicked on particularly right here, it says beginners. So each session title is carried to like whatever department that you're in, that you're currently at in the market. So if you're a beginner, start from beginner. If you're like more advanced, intermediate, you can just go straight to technical analysis, fundamental analysis, psychology, for the mental game, crypto talk. And then I have my indices bootcamp that I, re that I recorded, not recorded, that I hosted earlier this year. That recorded section is in there as well for all the, the three days where I brought out each different pair. Sinus chat bought all the recorded sessions that I've done in the past and then what he talks is just what he talks. So look, when you come and click on a video, right, it takes you just to the screen. The only thing that you see here is just the video, right? But now let's say you wanted to take the quiz, the quiz that comes into my academy. Let me zoom back out because it looks like it's getting kind of dark. But the quiz that comes with my academy, right? And if you want to, if you're in the academy, you're like, dang, okay, cool. Like, where's the quiz? I got to come to a whole different section up here. And the tag just to get to the quiz section right so my quizzes are in the whole separate section away from the videos like that's kind of irritating going back and forth so as a user learning more about user experience users user experience design like how can i make this more effective and more better for the user friendly experience for you guys i'm updating my academy now to where on uh, first of all on the course let me zoom in so y'all can see or actually Hey, just bring the whole camera over here so you ain't got to do all that. So on the course now, first of all, it's going to be like different sections. So right now I'm still updating everything. But as you can see, for those that don't know, like the value that I provide. Beginner section alone is already just an hour overall. So it's not really that long. You could dang it finish it in a day or two, whatever. And then obviously, as I begin to update all the other values, everything isn't updated just yet. So this will probably be done by the time y'all watching this video. Everything will be updated. This video is probably going to be released tomorrow on Sunday. It's currently Saturday, so... Updating all the videos that I have in technical analysis. So right now it's probably like over, I think it's like 30. I don't, I don't remember really remember the whole number. In total, I, in total, my academy in general, I have over 172 videos of gems to give y'all. But right now I'm, I'm slowly updating the academy for the new section of how it's gonna look. So here, I like this cool feature. Like it shows you as you're taking the academy, 
like as you pass each different session or watch each different video, it's gonna give you a percentage of how far you have to complete in the whole entire academy. So here's like the progress badge. And I feel like that's a cool feature. And then when you actually click on it, and it's a little check mark over there so you can know what you already watched. And then when you click on it, instead of you going to a whole nother session for the quiz, guess what? The quiz is now under each video. So that is what your boy is working on currently. Um Along with some other stuff, like, kind of like I'm brainstorming. Today is, like, my creative day, in a sense. Like, I'm thinking, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't start this video off and not even telling y'all. Because, obviously, well, if you don't know, if you don't follow me on Instagram, Instagram, all the other platforms already know. But I didn't tell y'all YouTube, my YouTube, my wealthy trader family. Yeah, I apologize. So, I'm going to try to, maybe I will end up editing this video and getting this video out to y'all by, like, 6 o'clock tonight. But, it's cool, though, because the Academy is going to be open for everybody. So, Academy is currently back open black friday still came early i decided to release everything a week early academy back open enter the discount code that's actually on the academy site for half off the academy so instead of paying 1300 it's currently now 650 to join uh the signal chats are all 175 one time fee for whatever chat you want just enroll on whichever one you want you get the signal chat for one time fee 175 ea bots are back available 2500 uh three bots select I lied. Two bots are currently left now. So, damn. Let me make sure I hurry up and upload this for y'all. Two bots are currently left now for the EAs. And then for my personal mentorship program, the personal mentorship program has actually opened back up as well. Uh, the first mentee that enrolls get the personal mentorship for 2024 for $5,000. After that mentorship uh, application is submitted, like after that person solidifies that spot, I'm only doing, I think I said I'm doing like four or three spots this year. Well, for next year, so for the next three spots, it's going to be $10,000. So the first person, I might just do three because I really want to make sure, like, like just know, like, when you pay that, I'm really going to be on your jump for real. We're going to be locked in for real. I have some of these I'm already locked in like this with for real now. I have some that um that would rather, like, kind of, like, do their thing and be a distance. Whichever one is you, that is totally okay, right? But from my experience and what I've been seeing, like, the, the more people that are, Talking to me, engaging with me, and reaching out with me more have seen way 10 times more results compared to the other ones that have not, right? Um, then again, I can't even say that because the other ones are still doing amazing too. So, but if you want faster, faster success, if you want hands on approach, like this isn't just your regular personal mentorship program that you see where these IG influencers or YouTube influencers are saying, Oh, yeah, I personally mentor you, and it's 10 of y'all. No. I make mine very exclusive. It's no more than three or four people in my personal mentorship program per year, right? And I'm making sure like I cater to those three, four people. And y'all getting that hands-on approach where you could text me, actually personally talk to me um, every single day if you want to. If you set up one-on-one -on -one calls with me every single day, I'm rocking with you every single day for those one-on-one -on -one calls because that's what you pay for, right? You're getting the full advantage of having access to me and since we're earning all the charts. So, whoever wants that, Whoever's, whoever I know who's seriously going to be my personal mentee for real, you will make sure you do what you need to do to make sure you're the first person to get the deal for $5,000 for the personal mentorship. But after that, the academy, I mean not the academy, the personal mentorship will be going up to $10,000. So, I'll leave you out with that. Right now, I'm about to get back to editing this. Uh, I might throw some B-roll footage right here of me recording myself doing this. And then, whatever else I end up doing today, I'll make sure I blow that as well. Maybe I'll play the game a little bit today too. I'm t I literally, this game literally just sits here and collects dust. Like my PS5, all I use my PS5 for is to charge my phone at my desk. That's literally the only thing I use it for. I don't even play the game. Like that's, that's type disrespectful. That's very disrespectful now that I think about it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, PS5. But, alright y'all. I'll chop it up with y'all in a few. Got work to do. So let me get back to it. Love yours. All right, y'all. Finally back. Finally done. Uh, updating the whole academy. I'm super excited with how it look. Like this jump looks fire. Why do I still have my coat on? I have no idea. Of course, we got the merch on. Actually, you know what? When I go pick up the new merch, that's actually well, technically it's already released on the site. But when I actually go pick it up, 
I'm gonna document document we're gonna record that record it behind the scenes of me and uh that might be either this episode or next episode, but we're gonna document the footage of me going to pick everything up. But that's not hard. Like I got three new designs that I like in particular, but it's the first one gonna be dropped. That's the one to check on C, but yes. It's not gonna be tough. But just finish this up and then Dang, I was about to talk to y'all about something. It's interesting, like, really bringing y'all into, like, the behind the light. Because all y'all know me as originally was what just trading, just a technical standpoint. Like, right now I'm showing y'all the behind the scenes of, like, what does it look like to actually run the academy and just having all this information, like, like all these gems on here, bro. All these different videos of beginners, technical analysis, fundamentals, psychology, crypto section, indices, the boot camp. This 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 video series right here. Each one of these is an hour long. Each one of these are gems. I'm telling you. Look, hour 15, hour and 30, hour. These boys right here, for my advanced people that's joining just for the advanced section. That right there. Cold. So I think I'm about to add a few more stuff and then we're about to go find us something to eat. And I'll chop it up with y'all at the restaurant wherever I decide to go. But until next time. You're not from Detroit if you don't see the SRT every now and then. Sheesh. I'm out of the plane too. For all my Mopar people on the channel, don't worry. It is not a Mopar coming, son. I'm trying. I will actually get a Mopar. I think I told y'all this before. I'm mad at camera. It's super dark in here right now, but don't worry. It'll only be a quick second before we get to our destination. But I um, like I actually love the scat packs and the SRT. I want to get scat pack. I probably get. I'll go ahead and get it, uh, the SRT Hillcat. You feel me? But um, that will be coming like. I won't. I don't think I'll get like a some type of wide body charger. That's the one I want. So a black wide body charger, a white wide body charger, and I'll probably go crazy on some type of wrap. But I wouldn't even get a car like that until like um, later on down in life. Like, like once I'm out of the state and everything, back back in the other states that I'm in, the cities that I'm in, then I get that car to represent for Detroit. Cause it's like, all right, yeah, you from Detroit? You driving a Mopar? You you you, you, from, you got a charger? You gotta be from the city. And I'm be like, yep, I sure am. And that's gonna be one of those cars where, like, my dad. Back, he already got his car from back in the day that he used to, well, he don't got it now, but back in the day, he used to tell him about a car that he used to drive all the time. Like, yeah, like that was my car back in the day. We used to always drive those cars, speed never, da, da, da. And then that car for us, from uh, for my kids, when I tell them, like for our generation, if you live in Detroit, you know, like the city car is a Charger, some form of a Charger, a Challenger, a Camaro. But really, I would say more towards like the Mopars, for sure around the city, like big facts. It'd be funny, like, if I'm eating my words right now, like, later on down the line, I end up getting a Camaro, but I like Camaros, too. Like, that used to be one of my favorite cars back in the day, too, because my older cousin used to have, like, a, a Bumblebee Camaro. Like, that junk was so beautiful, bro. Like, if I can find a picture, maybe I'll upload it in this video. I think I may have uploaded it in one of my old YouTube videos, now I think about it, but that car was so beautiful. That's when I first fell in love with Camaros, but now that I'm older, like, I'm more into, like, uh, I think like the foreign cars and I fell in love with the Benz, the BMWs, like, and then recently, uh, I finally got hit to like the, uh, the Audis for real. Like my cousin, he had a, a Audi A7 and he modified that junk. Oh my God, like that acceleration. You love to see it. Like that's what got me hit to the Audis acceleration. Like I love how fast that car was when he took off. Like, beautiful. So. We'll talk more about it, plus some other stuff I want to chop it up with y'all about once we actually get to the, uh, the restaurant. I'll pick you back up then. Peace out. Now, when I say the restaurant, I hope y'all didn't think I was talking about something crazy. We about to get us some days, boy. Oh, my God. If you know, you know. Mm, mm, mm. Alright, so just ordered uh, a number two. I actually show y'all. You know what? I'm about to do some fat jam. We're gonna do a B roll of the food. But hopefully the appearance of the food is good. Cause I'm about to make it this so fire on this recording. But got me a number two, one medium, 
uh, chicken sandwich and one mild spice level chicken sandwich. Then they come with fries, but y'all can hear the music in the background. So I might go somewhere that's quieter in the back. Hopefully the music isn't loud back there. Once I get my food, and then I'll chop it up with y'all then. The music is still loud, so hopefully it's not too loud. I don't get copyrighted and straight, but I ain't gonna lie. That footage was probably terrible. These sandwiches look like they was mushed. <laughs> Alright, so I was about to move, and then I thought about it, and uh, it's just so quiet back here that I hear a big old echo of my soul talking. So I was like, dang. Mm -hmm. Let me scoot the camera back so y'all can see. I can't wait to have my new camera, bro. The lens is on my tub. Mm -hmm. Dave's got seasonal salt and fries. Their own special Dave sauce. What am I, a food critic? I'm over here telling myself, hmm. Tomorrow, this is not Keith Lee, this is A. Love yours. No so this year I just been locked in for real. Like, not really going out. Going out here and there, but nothing crazy. Not really traveling. Traveling just a little bit, but nothing super absurd. And I'm like, but it's paid off. Like all the hard work I've been doing, how how locked in, how focused I've been this year. This is ridiculous. My money we made it off the markets. Even if I talk about just like this last month with me switching my schedule to waking up early, changed the game, bro. Like, opened my perspective to a whole nother level. Like, I thought I was going crazy before, but now that I'm actually going crazy, waking up super early in the morning, 4 a.m. for the London session, like 3 a.m., bro, like, and now, as we go into 2024, I'm ready to take some trips, man. I'm ready to really travel throughout the country. If you follow my Instagram, so I'm talking about how quarter one, I'm considering basically like maybe either a month or really just the whole quarter one, figuring out where I want to be at for the whole month. Like I, I, do, I really want to just be out the country for a whole month, just bobbing. Chilling, reconnecting with the earth and the world. I'm talking about the earth. What am I talking about right now, bro? <laughs> but just about that 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 peace, that vibe, that energy, you know, like like really being se separated and just locked solely just in trading in a whole other country, just traveling the world, having fun. Done with the charts, I found done with my meetings with my mentees, done with my meetings with my academy members. Like you go from trading during New York trade in London to walking outside to just water. Vibes on the beach. Go learn about other cultures. Coming back being uh, bilingual. You feel me? Like, and that's hard. I'm gonna come back to the states, speaking a whole other language. And then I feel like that'd be cool for the YouTube channel. Like, seeing like a day trader actually traveling the world, you know, out the country. Or staying out the country and just showing y'all like what that looks like. So I feel like I've seen some videos like that, but I haven't seen like a lot for real. And I actually like traveling for real. Like it's really been tough, like just staying in the crib and just locking in. Cause I'm ready to be outside, like just not even outside like that. But more so like just like a breath of fresh air. Like there's more to life than just America. Like, and I know if you're watching this video and you're from another country, I know I have people from another country watching me as well. Like, like I want to see what your country is about. You feel me? Like, the places that's on my radar, London, excuse me, London, Brazil, um, what else? London, Brazil, Tokyo. I want to go to Tokyo. I want to go to Japan during cherry blossom season. So spring, that's where I'm going to be at. Um, let me take a bite of this because I don't like it.
always not focusing on this gentleman is fired hard. But like I'm just giving you an idea of where I'm trying to be at. Like, I'm gonna be in the States too, but out the country. Wow. Mm. Oh, how can I forget? Dubai. And you know what the best part about it is? I'm traveling for my business. It's a business experience. If you know, you know. Letting everybody know. Your boy is officially back on the market. So all you single ladies out there. I'm back. I'm back out there. This whole year, I was like, bro, I'm not doing nothing else, focusing solely on the business. Knock out everything I need to knock out. Now we're about to have fun. So, obviously, don't come my DMs if you're not on that type of time, that wavelength, you feel me? Mindset wise. But, I'm letting y'all know. Y'all get what I'm saying. That's crazy. So let me eat this. Like I said, I might chop it up with y'all a little bit outside. Depending on how cold it is. But yeah, man. Traveling all 2024. So you with my friends or you somebody. If I am looking for I need a first of all, I need a person anyway, you feel me? That's how I sign back outside. You wanna travel the world with me? Let's get it. Passport about to get ready to come in the mail. I'm not playing. We are out of here until damn near the second week, if not the first week. All right, y'all, we back in the whip. So I was gonna talk to you outside, but then I remember they had music outside too. So that didn't help anything. So I'm gonna talk to y'all either here as well, or probably when I just get back to the crib, because I actually do. I might give y'all something later on in this video. But so like I said earlier, like I was really like debating on just drive, I'm not driving, I'm tripping. Just uh, really just traveling, just at first I was saying like a whole quarter, a whole quarter is kind of OD, I ain't gonna lie. Cause that's, that means that's literally like three to four months out of the entire year of being in a whole other country. Like I don't want to underestimate uh, what that looks like when it comes to like the lifestyle really changing as far as like what I could eat, what I could uh, do, like the laws I have to abide by, all the different rules and stuff, like you feel me? So, Plus, I saw a TikTok where a girl was like, oh, I thought it was going to be so easy to move from America to... Where did she move to? I want to say she moved to, like... Where was it? Was it Brazil? Was it... It was out of Brazil, or it was... I want to say... I don't know the other area, but... You know what? Another country that I wouldn't mind living in for real? Two places. I think one of them was... It may have been Brazil for me. And then the other one is Dubai. Just because of the wealth. Like, surrounding myself with that amount of wealth... I can only imagine like the amount of like the connections I would make, the network, the, like surround myself with high value people 24 seven. The laws where you really don't got to worry about somebody stealing your car because they know they'll go to jail for it for however many years it is or something bad. Have to, like different things like that, like, like that's a fire. Like when we talk about like American our economy and just stuff like in general, like obviously I'm, hold on, let, let the camera refocus since we got some light. Shout out to the red light special, but obviously like, America, like for those that from are from like other countries where the economy is not doing great, I understand why America might seem like the place to be, right? I am truly humble and grateful for um, for that. I'm truly humble and grateful for being from America because of the opportunities that we do have here and how basically how honestly compared to other countries, I'm not taking that away for y'all. You feel me? Like it's very luxury compared to a lot of people in the world. Like everybody financial background different. People don't like the stuff that we be complaining. Americans, I'm talking to my American people right now that's following me. The stuff that we be complaining about be, be so pointless, bro. Like, there are people out there having real world life problems. And we crying about gas prices going up. Or we're crying about, uh, what's, what's, some, what's, what's something random? Oh, McDonald prices. Something, like, something petty going up. I, even though McDonald prices going up, it is valid. But no, but like, it's real life world issues going on. And I ain't about to get too deep into that on my, uh, 
on his YouTube channel. But like, it's real problems out there. You feel me? So like, I am appreciative of being from America, but at the same time, for my people in particular, like obviously, y'all know what I'm referring to. Like, it still wasn't really made for us either. You feel me? Like, and it's still different problems that we still face today. And obviously, as I gain wealth and, and learn more about different cultures and learn different about other countries and understanding the pros and cons, I might decide on actually leaving the states and really just getting out of America. Like I love, I'm gonna have my fun with like all my materialistic stuff, like as far as like the cars I want, uh, just everything, cars, traveling, doing fun stuff. Obviously, we getting all, all out of our systems still as well. But I understand the big picture that at the end of the day. All the material stuff I, that y'all probably be seeing on my in my YouTube channel or just on Instagram, everything I'm getting, like I love it because I I grew up loving cars, so that's never gonna change the fact that I'm always set of cars that I want to have. Point blank, period, right? But I do understand that it is just materialistic stuff, and at the end of the day, experiences and living life more and being humble and respectable is more satisfying, more fulfilling than me trying to just. Uh, just get these a lot of materialistic things for no reason now i have my like i said for me i do have my cars in particular like i actually do want like i grew up wanting these cars my dream cars uh some people know what it is some people don't right like my dad's a mechanic he has cars that he like so i naturally gained the habit of liking cars i grew up on fast and furious fast and furious is actually one of my favorite i feel like every car person says that like fast and furious is definitely like if they know every car person favorite movie like or one of them if it's not in your conversation you're not a real car person but i'm not trying to hear nothing you talking about i'm sorry but like that is my favorite you know what we about to watch that tonight but that is my favorite movie series uh besides harry potter shout out to my harry potter people besides harry potter that is one of my favorite movie series of all time for sure so i have my cars like even not even just the exotics but like my what is that? Uh, what's that? But even like the the sleeper cars that y'all probably not even here to, unless you watch the show, you know what I'm talking about. But like even those cars, I would love to drive one of those. Like bro, like it's gonna be lit. Like I'm excited for everything that's coming, everything I want. Like everything that y'all see on my page, on my YouTube, or even on Instagram, is genuinely gonna be for me. Like if it's a car that I want, like I might ask y'all, cause obviously the cars I'm picking between, like I actually want those cars too. But like I might ask y'all here and there, whatever car I want or which I think I should get. But at the end of the day, like I'm gonna do what make me happy. Cause at the end of the day, y'all gotta watch, y'all watching me for me. If you don't like my channel, go ahead and get up out of here. But if you actually wanna rock with me, actually want an authentic person living life and not living to impress anybody else, but living for himself and impacting others, then you found the right YouTube channel. So, I think I'm gonna end this here. Let me focus on driving. And I might chop it up with y'all when I get back to the crib. What's going on, you guys? What's going on? So it's currently the next day. Uh, got a busy day. I had it was just 10 a.m. And I was like, you know what? I got some game I wanna get to them. So obviously, you guys already know since it's Sunday, in this video, y'all are gonna receive the Sunday breakdown analysis, but I'm gonna switch it up for today. Really, this probably like will be rare that I do something like this or maybe every now and then maybe I'll drop like a like a random video that I released to my academy just to give y'all like some free sauce too but like I got hella gems that's already recorded in my YouTube section and stuff that I could release to the public but we'll see how I feel about that so what I'm gonna do today specifically um I'm gonna give y'all a breakdown we're gonna do a full breakdown on i need to decide what pair i'm gonna do like why is my monitor over here tripping i need to decide which pair i'm gonna do it's probably gonna be let's do one i actually never done on the channel yet let's do nas 100 so i'm gonna go full in detail a full breakdown nas 100 i'm going over basically like overall how it's been moving how you can trade it how it's been for this whole year in general what am i what is my predictions for next year as we go into 2024 like Everything the whole nine about NAS 100. Let's really go like full throttle and just give y'all some game on how to trade it. So, without further ado, and actually, you know what? That's gonna be the free, the free trade setup that I'll give y'all today, too. So, usually I do SPS and US 30, that was the ones for the last two weeks. But this week is gonna be NAS 100, and then next week is probably gonna be Germany 40, because why not? 
uh, obviously this week probably will be a little bit slower because as you guys know it's Thanksgiving so if it's holidays the markets probably won't be busting as much um, as we start to get to Thursday but then again on Friday Wednesday anywhere between Monday through Wednesday should be smooth and then Friday I don't really trade on Fridays, but Fridays could be another day where the market's actually going crazy because it is going to be Black Friday. Everybody's going to be spending a lot of money in the market. So it's going to be cool. We're going to see. We're going to see how it's looking. So without further ado, let's get into this breakdown. I know the video is probably already at like 30 something minutes, but the, the real game, the real sauce is about to happen right now. So I'll catch y'all on the charts. <laughs> 